to give you an idea, it took us three days to cut that. And so the boys are just finishing up the last, uh, the last bits. Well, not the last, there's still quite a bit, but hopefully they'll finish that today. But we also finished my vegetable garden. So there's this beautiful large space. And today is it's gonna be my project to plant everything in here. I hope you can hear me over that saw. <laughs> I spent about three hours last night planning everything in my little book. So I basically wrote down everything that I have and how many, the quantities of them and then how far apart they need to be spaced, um, both uh, in width or in, in terms of rows and each other. And then I kind of made a general grid for how those plants are gonna look in my garden based on um, companion planting and stuff like that. It's definitely not a perfect arrangement, but it's the best I can do for this year. here my neighbor again installed this really cute little lock here so I can get nicely in and then here we have cabbage three rows of potatoes over here I've got uh, pie pumpkins this is all honey nut squash um, here we've got I don't know what the order is but there's butternut zucchini and delicata squash um, here i don't remember what order but i think it's radishes peas beans and beets over there um, then we've got kale uh, over here we've got watermelon three watermelon plants here we've got curry squash then i've got broccoli cucumbers here we've got parsley onion celery um, and then two sections here of bell peppers then here we've got two sections of tomatoes i think i have three or four varieties mixed in there uh, we've got three rows of leeks two rows of different types of lettuce and that is basic oh <laughs> hello How's your wood chopping going? Or wood piling? I need some advice. How are you making out? <laughs> 